Come on! All right, now we're going for the big splurge. We're going to Senia in Honolulu. We're going with Megan Murphy, who's a great food and travel writer. She's a friend of mine, and I wanted to treat her to this great dinner. Hello! Hello. Hi. <laughs> Happy Chris. to meet you. Chris. Aloha, That's Megan. Nice, nice to Anthony. meet you. This is Anthony and Chris. This is their restaurant, and they met working for Thomas Keller at the French Laundry and Per Se. Oh, look at that beauty. We have a blood orange ice cube. This one's named uh, after my granddad. It's called the Freddy. It's because he liked his whiskey and his bourbon. So we have oak smoked chips, bourbon, lemon juice, chestnut honey. You already know that's good. Cheers. To you. To you, Phil. To Hawaii. Everyone starts their meal with some snacks. This is our rendition of poke. So it's on a squinting rice cracker. There's a little uh, avocado, ponzu. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. That's really good. And this is kind of our tribute to our time in New York, Second Avenue Deli. What we did was we took chicken liver, just a little buttermilk and dried peach. <laughs> and here, this is a caramelized onion and everything spiced financiers. A tribute to the Second Avenue Deli is pretty fantastic. You gotta put a schmear on there. Yeah. Right, and I'll schmear. There you go. You took a very dainty schmear. <laughs> That's how you schmear. There you go. You out schmeared me. Cheers. Mmm. It's a luxury ingredient paired with a local ingredient, the local being hot of palm. And then there's a soft hush quail egg with uh, our own senia caviar and fried hot of palm on top. Holy moly. Oh. So we have a Maui venison tartare, a little bit of burgundy truffle shaved on top as well. Look at all this truffle. <laughs> oh, that's a decadent bite. <laughs> this is not what you would consider Hawaiian food. There are right? like, you know, so like the poke, there are definitely elements of it. Yes. Mixed with the French technique, fine dining background of the yes. chefs. This is the food of a modern city. Yeah. This is insane. People, <laughs> do you see this? The black salt, the white salt, the pink salt. Can't we all just get along? Here. Oh, wow. We're going to make you eat your vegetables. It's a cabbage that we basically treat like a piece of meat. That's how I'm usually treated. <laughs> the green potter is a local plant called moringa. Wow, cabbage. I like cabbage. I think cabbage is underrated. I'm with you. Yeah. So this is wagyu short rib. We cook in a pay pot right on top of truffle rice. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. Is there a little truffle on the, on the edges too? Uh, it's actually a pastrami spice. You guys are Jewish. <laughs> a hot smoked salmon. Uh, it's smoked three times. Smoked raw, smoked when we cook it, and it's smoked again now. Oh. Oh, wow. Wow! I only want my salmon smoked three times from now on. <gasps> Thank you so much. What? That's incredible. So many flavors and textures going on. Genius. Wow. I'm having fun. You want another? Yeah. Yes? I do it. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm hollow. Mahalo. And if the price is right, this can be yours. <laughs> I think we just gotta go right yeah, down, do it. right? Destroy. Oh, ah. It's very flaky. It's no chocolate. I think you'll maybe like it. Wow. That's really good. Banana-y. You should have it, yeah. Come here, let me. <laughs> Give hugs. You. you gotta hug a chef who does this. <laughs> that was absolutely fantastic. Now I jog around Honolulu. <laughs>